working in film and Hollywood was really beastly. We were treated so badly. Mm. Legendary actress Rita Moreno keeps it real on the red carpet tonight as Hollywood honors actors. CBS 2 entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez joins us now with more on the 24th Screen Actors Guild Awards. Well, she didn't mince any words, Rita Moreno. She's a classy, smart lady, though. Oh, yeah, and that's just one of the things yeah. she had to say this <laughs> evening. Now, Julia Louis-Dreyfus had to miss the ceremony because of her breast cancer treatments, but she won two tonight, and now she has nine in all, making her the most decorated actor in the awards history. Tonight was all about the women, from all-female presenters to a host for the first time, Kristen Bell. The SAG Awards' first-ever host took aim at First Lady Melania Trump. I think my first initiative as First Lady will be cyberbullying because I have yet to see any progress made on that problem quite yet. The Time's Up movement is moving forward. Rosanna Arquette, who came forward saying Harvey Weinstein sexually assaulted her, appeared on stage with Marissa Tomei. We can control our own destiny. And Rosanna, you are one of those voices. You're one of the silence breakers, and we all owe you a debt of gratitude. During the show, cameras mostly avoided nominee James Franco until his name was called in the Best Actor category. Aziz Ansari was a nominee but skipped the ceremony after a woman came forward accusing him of inappropriate behavior. Oh my goodness. SAG winner Allison Janney alluded to the allegations against him backstage. I mean, there's certain abuses that are just undeniable and others that are miscommunications and mis just. I was saying on the press line earlier how I think there's a new national safe word, which is I'm, I'm uncomfortable. I am uncomfortable, and that is that something that should transcend every single, you know, industry. Sam Rockwell. In his speech, Best Supporting Actor winner Sam Rockwell voiced solidarity with women and praised his co-star and fellow SAG winner, Frances McDormand. You're a powerhouse. I'm in awe of you, and I stand shoulder to shoulder with you and all the incredible women in this room. For trying to make things better. It's long overdue. Nicole Kidman. Woo! SAG winner Nicole Kidman thanked women before her for paving the way. 20 years ago, we were pretty washed up by this stage in our lives. Backstage, she said. Right now, for um, the voices of the voiceless to be heard, it's an incredible time. Um, can everyone do more? Absolutely. Sterling K. Brown, who won for Best Actor in a TV Drama, says if time's up for the treatment of women, we should extend that to the top. If we had President number 44 talking about grabbing people by the I don't think he'd still be working. You know, he wouldn't last it eight years. So it is representation, diversity, making sure that everyone's voice can be heard is important. James Franco did not walk the carpet, though his brother and sister-in-law, Alison Brie, did. If you see James Franco, say Rita Moreno doesn't want to talk to you. In general, people felt this wasn't a moment, it's a movement. I think it's, I think it's wonderful, I think it's real, and I think it will prevail. I feel like the rest of the world is just catching up to the way that some of us were raised in the first place. Morgan Freeman won the Lifetime Achievement Award tonight and called out the award for being gender specific. It is male. And did you know this? He didn't get a start in the film industry until he was 50 years old. Wow. And he's 80, so 30 years. It seems like we've known him really? for 50 right, years, right, right? right? That's incredible I, when you think about it. Because he was in Driving Miss Daisy back in 1989. Mm -hmm. Was that his first role? I don't know if it was his I, very yeah. first role, but that was his most famous. That's what really broke him out. Yeah. But Interesting. shows you it's never too late. No. I never thought about that. Just assumed he's been around forever because it feels like that. So he's... that award definitely, I mean, wow, yes. what an impact Good. he's made. Absolutely. Thanks, Suzanne. Thank you.